Hello, what's going on guys? Welcome to the Backstreet's YouTube channel. I'm of course your host, Kelvin Liu. This is a channel where we talk about bags, do bag reviews, give tips related to bags and all that sort of good stuff. And today, we need to have a serious conversation about the pyramids. But before that, let's roll that intro. As you can tell, today is an unboxing session as well. So I'm not going to reveal this bag, but instead, I just want to show it to you guys what we have here out of the box. So to kickstart the video, I just want to give you guys an introduction about the pyramid. So pyramid is a two-way bucket bag that can be switched uh, easily from a crossbody bag to a small backpack uh, with this uh, detachable shoulder straps. The Nomad Series Pyramid comes in two colors, which are black and stone. It also comes in different sizes. Pyramid is made with 600D Reprieve Polyester, and you may be wondering why most of the reason donut bags are made with a Reprieve Polyester. You know what? In 2019, Donut Wild to make changes to protect the environment visualizing a sustainable manufacturing chain with the goal of zero emissions. So they decided to incorporate Reprieve Polyester in crafting their bags. Uh, does this tone sound encouraging? Uh? Okay, uh? good. Uh? Okay, so what is Reprieve Polyester? It is a sustainable textile made from collected plastic bottles that have been put into a vertically integrated process which alleviates resource depletion and minimizes plastic pollution. What is cool about this material is that it is strong and durable. It can resist stretching and shrinkage. It dries up quickly. It is resilient, able to recoil or spring back into its original shape after bending, stretching, or being compressed. And not to mention, it is abrasion resistant and resistant to most chemicals as well. But still, let us not try to abuse them, okay? Well, all jokes aside, uh, that is pretty cool, man. Okay, let's get into detail of this bag. So this bag is drawstring closure kind of design. Let me show you. Yeah. It's a drawstring closure kind of design. And it comes with these uh, buckles as well. So from the outside, I can see um, there are one, two, three. Three zipper pockets. Let's look at the inner compartment. Basically, there's nothing much here. There's only one, uh, one pocket here. As for the inner lining, it is made of recycled material as well. It meets the global recycle standard, GRS, which was originally developed by Control Union Certifications in 2008. Um, one side note though, I guess because it is made with uh, recycled polyester, that's why it feels a bit rough. Uh, but who cares, man? Because we are saving the world by using this material, right? So this is the main compartment. Basically, um, you can feed in your water bottle or a tablet. Yeah, this is my Surface tablet. There's still plenty of room once I insert my Surface tablet. What else? Changeable clothes or uh, notebooks, daily necessities. Let's see if this can fit in my 13 inch MacBook Pro. Not really, because once you put in your laptop, uh, you're not able to close them. So let me try and see. Yeah, you can, but the shape, uh, looks pretty awkward but that's fine if you're okay with it just be careful you can also put them in uh, vertically just like that but I don't recommend it but um, it's still workable and let's check out a pocket here once you unbuckle this this can actually turns into a toiletry bag I hear you you doubt that let me show you how you open up these buttons here and then pull these zippers open. Then it is basically a separate bag. For this toiletry bag, you can fit in your toothbrush, toothpaste, shampoos, 
your facial wash and even sunglasses. Don't judge me, these sunglasses used to belong to my mother. So I guess with this uh, toiletry bag, you can save a lot of luggage or backpack space when you're out for camping or a trip. Not to mention that this bag actually has another small pocket at the back. And this part of the bag is actually covered with a mesh lining. Yeah, so I guess that's about it. So next, let's move on to the Pyramid Tiny, shall we? Ta-da! As you can tell, Tiny basically looks the same but just small in the Pyramid Bucket bag. Um, it also can be carried as a backpack, a sling bag, or just carry them with the handles here, but uh, there's no toiletry bag. It still have three pockets from the outside, from what I can see. Inside of the bag, uh, there's two pockets here. This is actually a padded uh, cell phone compartment. It's quite thin, not, not, a, not a thick padded uh, cell phone compartment. Look at that. This bag was trash. It is made from recycled water bottles. I still find it pretty interesting, man, that we can save the world by just simply uh, using this material. It can fit in basically everything except the things that are bigger than this bag. Um, makes sense, right? Let's try my Surface uh, tablet here. Just to give you an idea. Um, yeah, it's um, not really able to. Oh, if I put them uh, horizontally, yeah, I'm still able to fit them in. But again, this will turn the back into an outward shape. Uh, I don't really recommend them. But if you're okay with that, then it's totally cool. Yep, that's about it. Okay. Next, let's move on to the Limelight series. This is in dark rainbow color. You know, the tagline for this series is embrace your shiny hidden side. And this series is crafted to inspire and encourage us to stop hiding our shadow self uh, from the world and stop worrying uh, about being judged and embrace your shiny hidden side. Shine bright like a diamond, bro. And sis, uh, what is this actually? Donut filter? Place me in front of lens or flash. Huh, interesting. Well, this is actually for you to get creative with your photography. Um, yeah, pretty interesting. This series utilizes a special fabric, a mixture of 240T reflective holographic polyester and 400D glossy nylon. Looks dull gray under natural daylight and will turn into a hologram color under strong lights. The color becomes even more saturated and intense by the use of a smartphone flash. See? Nice or not? Um, I guess it's not dramatic enough, right? Cut to the B-roll, ladies and gentlemen. Bonk. So I don't want to go into detail on this bag because this bag is basically uh, the same with the Nomad uh, pyramid and I think the color is very cool so I decided to show it to you guys. Just some cleaning tips for this reflective bag. Uh, you should not wash or dry clean this bag as uh, it will reduce the reflectivity. You can just wipe it with a soft linen-free cloth uh, when you see any dirty spots on it. And if you're going to keep it away, you know, try to stuff something into it uh, to maintain the shape and also store it in a uh, dry and cold place. Yeah, I guess uh, that's about it. I hope you all find this video helpful and entertaining and feel free to follow us on Instagram. And if you would like to bring home one of these beauties, check out the links in the description below. As usual, if you like this video, please gently smash that thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel. Turn on the notification bell as well so that you'll be notified once we uploaded a new video. And don't forget to leave us some comments, suggest us anything, and what bag you want us to reveal. That's it for me now. See you in the next video. Okay? Bye.